Let me let me let you uh, hear what um, one member of Congress um, had to say. Hakeem Jeffries. He spoke to our own Katie Tour, okay. and he was talking actually about your press conference. But this was him talking not just about Trump but about his team. Take a listen. Okay. What do you make of him asking April Ryan to set up that meeting? It was very strange, but he's done a lot of strange things over the last 28 days, uh, and hopefully some of his advisors have informed him, one, that a letter has already been sent to him, uh, and that we're looking forward to an open dialogue. Steve Bannon, however, should not be in the room. Why not? Well, listen, he's a stone-cold racist and a white supremacist sympathizer. It'd be hard for me to participate in any meeting with Steve Bannon that normalizes his presence in the White House. Beyond that, we'll have to see. So, April, just from your reporting, are there more members of the CBC who are saying if they get their meeting, they don't want Steve Bannon in the room? That's one part, my, part A of my question. And part B, do you have the sense that because people like Bannon are around Donald Trump, that's reinforcing this sort of view of, of, uh, yeah. of, of black people as just a stereotype? Well, I haven't heard any anyone else beyond uh, Congressman Hiking Jeffrey say that, but I've also heard from uh, Cedric Richmond, uh, who th is the head of the CBC, who says he will have, uh, um, they, they are going to have this meeting because the White House did reach out to them not long after that press conference Thursday, and they're trying to pinpoint a date and time. 